Hi everyone. In this quick video, I want to show you proof that the Laplace transform operator is indeed linear. In the previous video, I explained how the superposition principle works in determining if a mathematical operator is linear or not. So I would check out that video first before continuing here if you are unsure. So to prove the Laplace transform is a linear operator, we begin with the additivity test. So to pass the additivity test, the Laplace transform of x plus y must equal the sum of the Laplaces of the two terms. So let's expand this more and write the Laplace transform of x plus y. But let's remember something about integrals. If we have two functions, let's say f and g, we can separate them and evaluate them separately. So let's go back to our additivity test and do that. From here, we should notice that the first term is indeed the Laplace transform of x, and the second term is the Laplace transform of y. And since this is what we were looking for to pass our additivity test, we can confidently say that this did indeed pass the additivity test. Now, let's move on to the homogeneity test. We write our function input times a scalar, which is c. And in order to pass this test, the result must be equivalent to the scalar outside the operator. So, as we can see here, it is certainly the same as the scalar term can simply be taken outside of our integral. Therefore, since the Laplace transform operator passes both the additivity and homogeneity test, it follows the superposition principle and is therefore a linear operator. I hope this video aided your understanding of why the Laplace transform operator is linear. Thank you for checking out this video. If you enjoyed, please like and subscribe to support the channel. However, if you have any comments, questions, or concerns about the information I provided in this video, please leave a comment down below and I will do my best to address your concerns.